Ready to boot it away, and the playoffs have started. Kick up the right-hand side, and it's short, and it's going to land at about the seven-yard line. DePaul lost that in the sun. You see Whitehead yeah, I don't with think his Whitehead hands up there it. underway. Motion from Quigley. They'll give it to him on the jet sweep, which is a popular play for DePaul. Turns Come it up. The field ball is loose, and it's scooped up by the Scots, and racing down the sideline is Jerome Robertson. One play, and the Scots are in the end zone. That's what they do. They cause those turnovers on possession one. Robertson knew what to do with it, his second TD of the year. Age Kruger, who has accounted for five two-point conversions already this year. We'll see what he's got. He's going to roll to his he's right, going to the pointing, corner. and he's just going to run it in himself. Cage Kruger makes it 8 nothing. Scott from the pistol. Get it back to McKay Hill. Try Baumgartner, just going to try to submarine for it, and this he's is got close. It. He's, he's got, got it. it. They pushed him backwards, but the initial surge enough to the 48. And Dunwoody at the left side of the line. Lines up, chases McCahill over to the right side as he pulls it on the option play and should have the first down come on as the slot receiver. Play action again, McCahill pulls it back, caught by Smith down at the 20, tries to get to the inside of Hum, good tackle by Drew there. DePaul looking to answer the early Alma defensive score. Whitehead slides through a small hole off right tackle and has the first down to about the 17. Quigley at a wing on the left, second and nine. Pulled by McCahill, rolling to his right, throws into the flat, caught by Quigley, being chased by Nelson down inside the 10 to the 6 as Kretschmar drives him out of bounds. One tying in a little bit tighter. Given off, no play action, thrown to the sideline, lobbing back, diving for it, Ballantyne, a great catch in the Ooh. end zone. He pulls it in, a little too much on that from McCahill. Ballantyne had half of the county to catch that in, but had to lay out and does so. Elma sends three to the left on first down. Hand off Eddie Williams with a little room to his left. A nice cut back and across the 45, heads towards midfield, crosses the midfield stripe before DePaul can run him down at the 48. Couch ready to snap it back. Given off, Williams again, same little sidestep, rolls over a tackler and down inside the 35 to the 34. Williams side by side with St. John in the gun. Stepping back with good protection, but nobody open. Thought about running with it, now just gonna try to keep it alive. Lob it down the sideline and Frenchko got run over and a he flag did. comes down. Pass interference, defense, number three. H back, second down and seven. Last minute of the first quarter. Jordan Williams, stutter step inside the five, looking for the end zone and finds it. The freshman scores, and it's 14 to seven. Looked like he had some pretty fresh legs in there, Tove. Sure did. There are no strangers to getting into the backfield, and Elma's going to get conservative with Eddie Williams, except he finds a lot of room across the 20 and a first down. The last thing DePaul wanted to see is a third and 12 pickup on the ground. Jordan Williams. Quick snap on first down, Eddie Williams again, weaving, bobbing right, left, across the 40. Still on his feet as he spins out of a tackle to the Lost 45, it. but now the ball loose. Can Jansen track it down? He does for Elma. Elma loses about 10 yards yeah. on the fumble. Goal line situation, but with St. John at quarterback. Gives it off. Jordan Williams has to burst to his left, but has the first down and now more across the 45 into DePaul territory and shoved out of bounds. Package this time. Fourth and two. St. John rolling to the right, throws over what the middle, caught by Webb, down inside the 20, racing to the sideline, what a block! It up, and it's Nate Webb diving for the end zone. The official's going to oh, think about at the it, one. they'll say he's out of bounds Lotterman at the with an one. incredible block, he took two or three out. First and goal, Elman now back at the seven. Motion to the left, St. John rolls right against the flow of the play, now cuts back inside <laughs> the five, and it's the seventh rushing touchdown of the year for number four. Beautifully blocked by that old line up there, and Carter knew right where to go. After Whitehead handled a lot of the first quarter, play action to him, thrown right sideline, caught by Ballantyne, nice cut inside of Hum, and Soferdini comes back to make the tackle in this first half. Motion from Quigley, a couple double play action fakes, then thrown to the sidelines. Trouble handling it by Smith, who makes the catch, but lost his momentum. He's still going to pick up the first down, I believe, to the Elma 48. Regular seasons. Third down and four, play action, and McCahill runs for it. Has it in some more, now cuts inside at the 30. Elma barely able to grab him by the waist. A good one-arm tackle by Soferdini. McHale straight away dropped, Elma brings pressure. Quick throw over the middle, Ballantyne caught and upended at the 15, but a first down and another good play. Alma again shows some pressure. Given off to Baumgartner, cuts inside, heads to his right, keeps trucking it in and hop on the bus. Gus, no need to discuss much about that. That is a huge touchdown for DePauw, number 12 on the year for Gus Baumgartner. And three down linemen. McCahill underneath, thrown, tipped up in the air and intercepted. Marlat to the 20, right behind a blocker, inside at the 15, outside at the 10 to the end zone. Scots have scored on defense for flag, the second time. Flag, 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 flag. Yep. But it may come back. 
Additional foul, illegal blindside block on the defense, number 26. Yep, that's Be exactly. The spot of the foul. So the, the Scots get the turnover, but the points come off the board. I'm left here. St. John play action, quick throw, sliding catch by Jansen. Oh, and he knelt down. He thought he was down. The officials didn't blow the whistle. If motion to the left. St. John play fake, straightaway drop, thrown out to the right sideline, and a grab over there by Lotterman at the 20 for the first down. Everything down, kicks up, has enough on it, and That's good. perfect, he didn't pull that one, boy. Right down the middle, and Elma <laughs> heads to the break with an 11 point lead, 25 to 14. DePaul, big time winning the field position game here. Kempf on the back of the Owen Scots, they bring a little bit of pressure, Kempf rushes it out of there with a liner that lands at the 35, bounces sideways, and Elma will fall on it, but terrific field position. Baumgartner, the running back beside junior Nathan McCahill. Quick shoulder fake, now they want to go long on the hitch and go, and they've got it inside the 15, Ballantyne tackled down at the seven yard line by Kretschmar. Hold down, kick tugged back from that right hash mark and through. 34, St. John from the shotgun, Brown again, tries to find it, and so many times as he did in high school, just enough to move those sticks just across the 35. It was wide to the left, second and 11, St. John looking over the middle, now long, trying to find French go, can he camp under this one? This time he's got it at the 30 and they're not gonna catch him. Tally it up, this one is 66 yards. Devin French goes in the end zone. That's what they do. St. John makes the adjustment to the wind and drops it right in the bread basket for six. Full alignment here, so expect room in the middle. From the pistol, Whitehead will take advantage of that. Room, room enough, yeah, not room much, enough. but there was enough. Out to the 27. Handoff up the middle, a little bit of a burst oh. and running into his own offensive lineman is Whitehead. He's going to get it, get it. but that had a big gain written all over it until he ran into the back of Tommy Martin. Third down and two, Baumgartner tumbles forward, has the first down at midfield. Well, he's got his heels on the 49 yard line. Hand off to Whitehead, gonna try to get outside to the right and he finds the space for the first down. A good burst, second and three. Hand off right up the middle with Baumgartner across the 30, another first down, not much more than that. We've got it second and three from the Elma 21, but trailing by 15. A Flare screen way out to the sideline, caught by Quigley. Good block by Ballantyne, slows down Garland until he can shove Quigley out of bounds at the 14 for a first down. Twin wide receivers to the left, including Roach. McCahill with all kinds of time, but nobody open. Now dances out, chased by Oswald, and Oswald's gonna get there for a sack back at the 22. Boy, Matt Oswald just never quit his pursuit, never stopped. Quigley along with Roach and Smith. McCahill drops to throw, well protected again. Looks into the end zone, up high, a lot of traffic in there, knocked away and incomplete. Marlat, Preston Marlat, knocked it to the ground. Ebb in motion to the left. High snap, pulled down, given to Jordan Williams. Sidestep, sidestep again out to the right, trying to find room and great pursuit by DePaul. Just no place for Jordan Williams to go. Four wide with Baumgartner in the backfield. McCahill wants to throw for it. Pressure comes and Robertson hauls him down. St. John wants to throw quickly. Frenchko at the 10, down inside the five, tumbling fumbled towards it. the end zone, fumbles the football. Let's see what the ruling yeah, is here. It's, it's recovered in the end zone. It's a fumble, still life for DePaul. Last gasp here for DePaul, trailing by 15 at their own 37 yard line. McKay Hill back to throw from the 30, looking to step up. Pressure comes from behind, and there's just no place to throw it. Dunwoody and others. Incredible. Sanderson as well. And fourth down and goal from the seven. Cahill flush to his right, given chase and he's hit as he throws by Robertson one more time. It's incomplete, the clock reads zeros. Elma has won the game.